Hi, I'm Jack, and this is Emma, aka Smiley. Last year we moved on to our boat in Nirvana in Scarborough Harbour. And Emma began learning to sail. We spent our time foraging the coasts and the shoreline. Before sailing away to the south coast where the true adventure begins. We spent a week at anchor, hiding from the bad weather in this beautiful anchorage down the river Dart. Now in Dartmouth, let us recap our terrible luck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Emma and I have now decided we're giving up sailing. We're staying here. We're gonna get drunk. We're gonna get drunk for the rest of the time. Never wash again. And we'd like to tell you why. <laughs> what happened on day one of this adventure, babe? One was pumped up because we had to go off. Jack's parents got us one straight away, so we thought that was an easy fix. They could pick up a, a pump and bring it to us. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> awesome, got one, fixed it. Day two. Anchored at Sharp House. We anchored at Sharp House, lovely little spot. Jack didn't like where we'd anchored, so we had to get the anchor back off and it was stuck. Stuck. Yeah, so stuck anchor for the first time on day two, but we managed to break it out, move, break, re anchor, happy days. So day three, back in the night to get a glass of water, new water pump problems. So day three, <laughs> and the pump breaks again. Basically, starts peeing water straight into the bilges as soon as the pressure builds up. Turns out the pump has 0.1 too much pressure. Yeah, so that meant no more washing. Hence. Slowly backwards as the tide's going out, get really, really close. <laughs> this shore's getting really close. <laughs> what you did miss when we just touch the bottom. Emma's on the phone to her parents. Emma, I need you right now. <laughs> Engine on. We just touched with the rudder and we got away. We had day four. Quite uneventful. Didn't we go foraging? Day five. Day five, foraging day. Got stuck thigh high in stinking mud. But. <laughs> <laughs> Day six. Day six. Leaking at the bottom of the bed. Bed leaks. Is it wet? Very wet. And then hopefully we'll be able to find some holes. Oh yeah. Do day seven. Day seven. We are coming down the dark. Happy days, we've got the sails up, we've got the ferries just starting to pull out and cross in front of us as we pass Dartsmouth. The engine completely conks out. She's gone down below <laughs> the engine cover, pulled it open, smoke <laughs> comes out. Sorry we didn't get this on camera. Uh, engine stalls, boom! Shit. Ferry pulling out. Car ferry pulling out in front of us. Actual currents taking us towards the ferry. <laughs> Onto the radio, we hear the guy from the ferry radio to the people in Dartsmouth. There's a yacht which has lost power, think it's uh, engine failure. They were right. Anyway, luckily we got rescued. Water from the slip where we were. Yeah, just pulled us straight across onto a pontoon, so it wasn't any big rescue mission. But now we're sat, you know, in Dartsmouth. On a pontoon. On a pontoon. Doing the rest of our lives. Yep. And some serious strippage coming from there. We've had the tools out and the engine apart. And I've finally got out this crazy pipe. There lies the problem. And I still can't get 